Hello and Assalamu alaikum everyone. I am a teacher and always have this problem. Before entering the classroom, my students often hold misconception about force. Misconception, what is that? Okay, here are some examples. Some students may believe heavy objects fall faster, while others think stationary objects experience no force. Those are the classic cases of misconception or alternative framework. Correcting this misconception requires effective communication between teachers and students. This process known as multimodal learning involving various modes of representation such as spoken language, written text, images, gesture and etc. This kind of communication will involve using multiple modes of representation, often focusing on meaning making. My study aims to explore how students grab the concept of force through multimodal inquiry learning. To achieve this, I employ a case study approach combining qualitative and quantitative methods. The data were gathered through observation, interviews, and also tests. They were then analyzed using descriptive and thematic analysis, including data triangulation. My analysis revealed that teachers utilize 30 modes of multiple representation, fostering at low level inquiry learning. Changing in student alternative framework or misconception has occurred through a three-phase meaning-making process, enhancing their understanding of false concept. This inquiry learning process offers a fresh perspective on reshaping student cognitive structure regarding false concept through meaning-making process. The framework as an output of this study will provide educators with insight to design more effective physics learning experience. Okay, wait. Now I have a question for you. As you are sitting and watching this presentation, are you exerting any force on the ground beneath you? Think about that question later, will you? It's a simple example of how forces are constantly at play in our everyday life. Thank you.